Last week we gave you the maiden flight of this bad boy. This is the Shendron's Sicario, and it's an amazing Cine Lifter platform. X8 7 inch props. We've got Brother Hobby motors on there, and DJI, and it has two T motor ESCs, and onboard back for a camera. But at that point, I didn't have the camera. I was still waiting for that to arrive. And now. I've received it. This is the Panasonic BGH-1 and it's an amazing little box camera. This thing only weighs 680 grams and as a result, it's an absurdly light camera that's able to shoot at 10-bit 422, which is a really fancy way of saying you can get a lot of information out of the picture of this camera. As a result, combining that super lightweight design with a cine lifter means that you can have a high performing cine lifting platform with a camera that doesn't compromise on pretty much anything. There's a couple small caveats. One, the Stead XP does not currently work with this, which is not a problem for me. I don't think that that's something that I'm necessarily going to need in my tool set, though I want to play around with it to because I want it to change my mind. <clears throat> And two, it doesn't have like a raw mode. It does have V-Log. It can shoot at a very, very, very desaturated mode that allows you to change the color profile the way that you want to later in the editing process, but there's still a lot that it kind of leaves on the table for that sort of thing. It uses micro four thirds lens, which means you can use this Lawa 7.5 millimeter lens, which is just absurdly small and absurdly light. This isn't even the lightweight of edition. There's a version of it that you can get it that's 20 grams lighter than this. And it's just, <laughs> it's just insane. You combine that with the Sicario and now you have a cine lifting platform that just has unparalleled performance in terms of you know having that extra threats to weight ratio that feeling of flying like a five inch quad with a gopro so with all of that information we're going to take this mount it up on this sicario and take it out on a little bit of an adventure we're going to get some footage to kind of basically start a reel though i can't really do a whole lot because i'm stuck here in indiana for the time being so i can't like go out and get some epic mountain dives or anything like that but we'll do what we can with what we've got so give me some patience and i hope that you enjoy the process of filming some footage with the bjh1 and the sicario one of the big important things that i want to be able to shoot well with the sicario with the bgh1 and get some tests for this thing is car shots obviously we need to be able to do car shots because that's all anybody wants with fpv stuff these days and so we got to get some test shots
Indiana's not really a very exciting place for roads, and we are only a crew of a couple people, so we can't like shut down a whole road and get some stuff. So we came out, we found a brand new development, and <laughs> we're going as hard as we can in basically a parking lot. But we got some awesome stuff with this. We use this tree line way over here uh, to be able to kind of cruise along the top and drop in and meet him. And we got some, you know, some chase shots, some lead shots, some kind of pop up over top. So excited to see what we got out of that. Uh, this thing flies like a dream, dude. Like I forgot that I was flying a five inch. I was like, there's some construction equipment over here. And I was like, oh, I'll just thread the needle through there. And I didn't really think about it. And maybe it was fine, but it was just like, I, rap! so I, I'm really excited about it. A little bit cold. So let's get back in the car and we'll go find more things to shoot with the Sicario. So the next shot I want to get with the Sicario that's really good for filming rigs is uh, just like kind of nice cruising. And there's this great little walkway that's like flooded right now around a lake that's kind of hidden over into those reeds. In order to get all the way around, we need to get some altitude. So we're going to just kind of climb up the top of this little hill here. We'll be able to go all the way around on that path and get some really sweet shots with the uh, BGH-1 Sicario Insta360 combination. The wombo combo, as it were. I'm using the phone app with the Panasonic BGH-1 to like check exposure and focus and all that because there's no screen on it, which is part of the reason it's so light. You can see how this hill gives us the proper vantage point to be able to get all the way around that lake and get some nice low cruising. So I'm really excited about that. Drone's ready, camera's ready, other camera's ready, other, other camera's ready. Let's get in the air. Oh yeah. I love this thing so much. All right, here we go. Ready? Ready? She don't care.
That thing is such a monster, dude. How'd that look? I don't even... I was asking the audience, but that's okay too. <laughs> I am uh, so excited about that thing. Like with that camera, it's just it's a freaking monster, dude. <laughs> and with two, well, with two cameras actually. All right, so we're done flying here with the cruising spot. Could definitely do more. That was really fun, but I don't think we need to. I think we got what we need. So now let's get some proximity. Get back in the woods. Let's do it. Okay, so we're back at Flat Fork Creek. We've got a couple shots left to get. All right, so we've got the Sicario mounted up, ready to rock. Cameras on there, BGH ones on there, batteries charged. We're heading back into the woods. Let's do it. This is the mud from the other day. So I flew the sick here already. I didn't have my BGH one yet, my my Cine camera. So we're going back at it. <laughs> it's muddy, muddy again, but wore the right shoes this time. Unlike my camera guy. Okay, so this was not one of our originally planned shots, but I just, there's this bridge right here that I have to fly the Sicario underneath to get that like feeling. I think it'll just be, I think it'll be a nice addition to the little reel we're trying to build here right now. So we're back in the same spot that we did the actual Maiden of the Sicario, except at that point we didn't have the Panasonic VGH-1. So we came back to the same spot to test out the same spot with and without the camera. So we spotted a couple pretty decent looking canopy dives. We're gonna chase it with the budget build because that's the only other drone we have with us. And we're gonna get some awesome 10-bit 422 Panasonic juicy looking footage. Let's get to it.
finished our first flight here in the woods. <laughs> Dude, it's amazing. I'm literally just like, rah, 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 rah. Like, I, I mean, it was very quickly before I forgot that this wasn't just a five inch drone or I forgot that this was a, not a five inch drone really quickly. Like I, was, I did a canopy dive. It wasn't a great one, but I mean, I don't want to risk it too much right now. I was getting a little bit weird video because Winston was powered on with the other drone. It just wasn't working for us. So I'm going to charge it up. We've done all of the other shots that we came here to do. And the only thing left is to go down the river. So <laughs> hopefully we don't put this brand new camera into the water, but I got to get the I'm good shot, ready man. For this Nothing's getting any better We were up all night Spending all of our time Dancing around three words We were doing just fine Started with Picking fights just to keep it alive How did we get to where our friends Are picking a side Holding hands, driving way too fast Past the warning signs now it's all on the line Seasons change, but I don't want them to change us In these days you've been saying my name different So afraid to see us fall, but it's imminent If I'm being honest, I'm not ready for this winter weather All right, so we got a day's worth of like just getting real shots. That's R-E-E-L shots. Uh, just something that we can show that we've got this thing in the air, that we're doing good stuff with it. I'm so excited about what we got today. I know it's not like the perfect stuff. Like I want to get some mountain dives and like chase some sort of like exotic car other than a Tesla, uh, stuff like that. So eventually we'll get more and more, but at least that's a good start for one day's worth of work. So Shendron Sicario, BGH1 in the air, getting shots, getting work done. I am so excited. I hope you guys enjoyed this whole video. Stay flying.